so glad to be here at the LIT program with you, Catherine. XLHR is a huge part of Christy Lake Kids. You've been supportive of us since 2005, given over $200,000 to the program. Tonight, we told the kids about the fact that we had an amazing $30,000 donation from you. It's incredible. We're thrilled, and thrilled isn't even the right word, but tell us a little bit about why XLHR chooses to help Christy Lake kids in this way every year. Oh, I'm, I'm glad you asked because it's associated with my late husband, Tony. Um, his full name is Antonio Romeo Barbosa Rodriguez Guimaraes, and Tony came from Portugal when he was little, he was three, and he was from a disadvantaged background, and it was very challenging at home. He was so fortunate to be selected and to be welcomed into the Christie Lake community when it was only boys then, but then converted, of course, to including girls. And he went to camp for many summers, and he also had the privilege of having mentors in the community. It wasn't called Leaders in Training, but it was very similar. And they mentored him and also gave him some support financially and emotionally to get to the next stage in his life. And so we started our company together when he was 23 and I was 21, and we had a youth venture loan. And he became a very hardworking, focused person on the future. And as soon as he made enough money that we were stable enough, he really wanted to give back. So 2005, we would have been in business about 14 years. Now we're at 30 years. And at the time, um, he, he wanted to be able to do something. So it was both financial or emotionally. Now he got sick, as you know, and got cancer and passed away. But before that happened, he would have liked to have been part of this Leaders in Training and to be there and to, to coach other young people. So I want to carry that legacy for him.